ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರುಭ್ಯೋ ನಮಃ ನಮಸ್ತೆ ಫ್ರೆಂಡ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಅಗೇನ್ ಎ ವೀಡಿಯೋ ಬೇಸ್ಡ್ ಅಪಾನ್ ಎ ರಿಕ್ವೆಸ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಒನ್ ಆಫ್ ಅವರ್ ಫ್ರೆಂಡ್ಸ್ ಟು ಕ್ರಿಯೇಟ್ ಎನ್ ಎಕ್ಸಲ್ ಫೈಲ್ ಟು ಟ್ರ್ಯಾಕ್ ದಿ ಅಸಂಟೆಂಟ್ ಸೊ ನವಾಂಸ ದಿ ಅಸಂಟೆಂಟ್ ಆನ್ ಎ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಫೋರ್ ಅವರ್ ಬೇಸಿಸ್ ಕೀಪ್ಸ್ ಚೇಂಜಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ಫ್ಯಾಕ್ಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಪಾಸಸ್ ಥ್ರೂ ಆಲ್ ದಿ ಸೈನ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಝೋಡಿಯಾಕ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದ ನವಾಂಸ ಚೇಂಜಸ್ ಮಚ್ ಮೋರ್ ಫಾಸ್ಟ್ ಫಾಸ್ಟರ್ ಇನ್ ಫ್ಯಾಕ್ಟ್ therefore uh, not only track the uh, signs through which it passes we also want to identify which are the poisonous navamsas the very dangerous uh, uh, what we call the vishan navamsas and which are the strong uh, vargotham navamsas which are uh, the basically auspicious pushkara navamsas if we can track it each minute by minute of a one uh, 24 hour day they will be able to identify maybe non poisonous uh, strong and pushkar navamshas to carry out uh, some activities like trading so this is what uh, the request was so we thought we can plunge in and put in an excel for that purpose so this is exactly what this excel is going to do i'll walk you through how it works the user's input is to give the date of birth the place here yeah, since he was interested in trading i gave mumbai the time zone uh, for india mumbai uh, and latitude longitude of that place you give and you can choose the ayanamsa that you prefer for this uh, sidereal astrology and how it is uh, structured is for a given date it uh, increments the time from the midnight every minute and calculates the ascendant rising at that time at this location on that date only that is the astrological calculation uh, of the longitude of the ascendant alone then all these are based upon this longitude we find what its nakshatra is uh, what its nakshatra lord is uh, which rasi basically the rasi number where it falls the ascendant falls what is the rashi in fact it is taurus now at this location and what is the d9 sign which is the navamsha sign at this time what is the d9 lord of the 108 padas which pada it is passing through of the nine padas which in the rashi with one sign of a rashi which pada number it is and based upon this information it finds out uh when it is going to change when the d9 uh ascendant change is going to happen so when the navamsha ascendant is going to change and here both d1 and d9 ascendant change is tracked here and if it is a visha navamsha here you have options like uh, the grida visha the sarpa visha the shukra visha and if it uh, if it is unpoisoned uh, locate that and we also have vargotama if the same rasi and navamsha fall at that time then it is a vargotama ascendant which is very uh, strong pushkara navamsha which is uh, a very auspicious navamsha so based upon this on a 24 hour uh, timeline so it starts with the 12 midnight and goes till the 12 midnight of the next day and one can uh, if you want to filter out uh, you want just the unpoisoned uh, times for the day you just click here it takes a while to filter because a lot of data is there and you get the unpoisoned uh, navamshas basically the times when things are unpoisoned uh, in terms of the navamsha so you you have a lot of choices here but still you within this you might make require uh, auspicious navamshas which are nice for you so you click on the pushkar navamsha and you want also stronger navamshas so you click on that as well so it will filter out to you exactly the times that the, all of these match you have an unpoisoned vargotama pushkar navamsha and you want to know when these things change when the navamsha changes so you just click when the navamsha changes so you have only these times when navamsha changes you have uh, 357 1146 in the night 357 in the afternoon 313 in the morning so only these things uh, three navamshas 
both change also you can have an option so uh, maybe if you are not interested much uh, in terms of vargotama you can filter out that I mean they, you can use it in your own way the, this is just a tool so the way you to use it i am not going to deal with this because uh, that's a different subject matter altogether so normally we prefer not only for trading we prefer uh, for other activities also that the navamsha be clear it's not poisoned it is quite strong it is uh, it's also auspicious so these things are uh, needed on a everyday basis for general mugartha also so i hope this is a useful tool for you uh, this is just of the ascendant alone you one can uh, track such things for other uh, bodies like uh, sun chandra everything just by giving the we have already erected formulas how to calculate the body's longitude so you just modify or maybe erect other columns for other bodies and you can track the changes uh, of all those uh, this way and uh, hopefully you can make use of this uh, for bhurta selection for trading and other such purposes i will put a link to this excel file download and make use of it and give us feedback thank you